Kano State has been designated as one of the areas vulnerable to flooding during this year's rainy season, with 14 local government areas identified as high-risk zones in the 2024 forecast. According to a report from the National Emergency Management Agency, several local governments, including Ajingi, Woodil, and other metropolitan areas, have already been impacted. The affected communities are urgently calling for intervention from the government and relevant stakeholders. Our building collapsed while other houses were completely destroyed and others, their rooftops were affected. In the house behind me, the parlor collapsed on our chairs and other properties. Government and all to do individuals should please help because a lot of people have been affected. However, proactive measures have been initiated by the Kano state government and other stakeholders to mitigate the effects of the impending flood. Despite these efforts, the state recently experienced continuous rainfall for 10 days, sparking fear among many residents. The situation demands continued vigilance and prompt action to minimize potential damage. In Kanu, Elizabeth Yila, NTA News.